Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at two different adaptogens that I've been taking. One is Gynostemma, which is also referred to as Jaguline or Miracle Grass. Jaguline is considered to be one of the most powerful adaptogens of the adaptogen family. We also have Rhodiola, another popular adaptogen. So, what is an adaptogen? In simple terms, it's a stabilizer or homeostasis, which allows for decreased cellular sensitivity to stress. Ideally, people take adaptogens to help reduce stress while bringing a balance to your state of being. If you're feeling a little overstimulated, stressed, or wound up, adaptogens will work to bring you to a calmer state. Whereas, if you're feeling a little fatigued, mentally or physically, it will help elevate you to a more alert and focused state. If you want a more detailed outline of adaptogens, Jaguline or Rhodiola, along with any potential side effects, simply click the About tab and show more for a listing of the links. I've personally not had any particular side effects from taking either product. Overall, both products have done a great job at providing me with a sense of ease and mental clarity. I've taken them by themselves and in combination. I've not found that one seems to be better or more effective than the other. However, they both seem to be able to bring out a great balance. You can get Gynostemma in its natural form, which is very much like tea leaves that you can make into a tea. However, like the rhodiola, I prefer the ease of taking it via pill form. I don't take either product on a regular basis, just at times when I feel I need a little bit of balance and mental clarity. If you're looking for an effective way to help relieve stress, fight fatigue, reduce elevated stimulated states to a more stable, calmer balance, and provide you with mental clarity, I'd recommend both the Gynostemma and Rhodiola as part of your stress management program. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click that like button and subscribe for future product reviews.